Hi, this is Seth Wild from SonicElectronics.com here at SEMA 2009. And we're here taking a look at some of the new Kicker products. And this is something that's brand new that's expected to come out in early of 2010, I believe. Um, and it's for motorcycles, specifically Harley Davidsons. Um, but we're gonna learn a little bit more about that right now. Thank you. This is our new PS5250 Power Sports 5 and a quarter. It's designed specifically as a replacement for a Harley Davidson, uh, any location on the bike, years 2006 and later. Uh, anything that requires a two ohm application. And uh, as a direct bolt in, they're about one and a half dB more efficient than the stock speaker. The biggest issue we run into with motorcycles is when you're at speed and you have loud pipes and you're wearing a helmet, conventional speakers just don't have the high frequency output to compensate for that. These were specifically designed with enhanced high frequencies to do just that. So you put these in, it'll play louder and just as clear as a bell at high speed, even wearing a helmet. Now there's some unique features about this uh, speaker that makes it a little bit different from the, your standard car speaker. Uh, what are some of those differences? Well, first of all, we have a tweeter suspended on a bridge. It's not running down a post. This way, when it's installed, it's effectively weatherproof. Uh, it uses an inverted Santa Green surround, so we get maximum excursion without touching the spokes of the bridge. It uses a neodymium magnet structure, which is significantly stronger than a conventional magnet, so we're able to get a very small, lightweight driver, weighs less than 13 ounces, yet it has more power than a conventional speaker. So because it's so light, it won't affect your handling. You don't want a lot of weight high up on the motorcycle because then you feel like you have something really big on your shoulders. Don't want that. Uh, it also has a, uh, an aluminum heat sink that actually does keep the magnet cool under high power, high heat applications. So uh, again, the name of the game is play loud, play long. You don't want anything breaking. Now as a being a two ohm speaker, uh, is that specifically just to put into the motorcycle and have it run off the factory? Or is there a, a specific purpose behind being a, it being a two ohm speaker? Well, an, initially we designed it to replace a factory Harley speaker, again, 2006 and later with the premium radio. That radio requires a two ohm driver, so this is a direct pop in replacement for it. But since it's two ohm, that doesn't mean uh, you can't use it other places. As long as your amplifier is two ohm stable per channel, you can use this with any conventional amplifier and get maximum power, again, if it's rated to go minimum or as low as two ohms a channel, you can make maximum power out of the amp with this. You do not want to use it in an uh, earlier Harley-Davidson application that requires an eight ohm speaker. Uh, you'll have a problem with that. Again, 2006 and later, awesome product. Now you mentioned specifically 2006 or later Harley Davidsons. Are there other motorcycles that this will also be uh, well, also work with? We have an amplifier. We have some other products that this would be perfectly compatible with. But as a power sports line, this is our first effort. And again, this was designed primarily as a replacement for the Harley Davidson stock speaker 2006 and later. It's a great alternative. Well, thank you very much, Dave. This is Seth Wild from Sonic Electronics here at the Kicker booth at SEMA 2009.